Don't forget to subscribe to Steven C. Killer. Now get back in the grave, gutbag! What's up, guys? Steven C. Killer here, bringing you another reaction. Now, today we're checking out the newest, the brand newest, the newest of the newest of Rewind, Rewind Rumble. Sounds a little odd for me. I'm also, my voice is a little out right now. But, guys, we're checking out Goku Black vs. Dark Sonic. Ooh, this is going to be an interesting fight. He's been hyping this channel up. I have subscribed. You guys should subscribe too. Link in the description below. Go support it because it's now going to be his main, like, not like his main channel, but his, like, main serious channel. Animation Rewind's main channel, which is Animation Rewind, is still going to have the Cartoon Fight Club fights, but also very uh, funny, meme fights. So, um, yeah. <clears throat> I have tea with me to help my voice because uh, I'm still recovering from Halloween and stuff like that. Because I was working at a scream park, uh, yelling and screaming at people. I scare the shit out of them. And, uh, yeah. We're here today to check out Goku Black vs. Dark Sonic. I'm gonna be on the side of Goku Black because if there's a fight between Goku and Sonic, I still think, uh, Sonic would lose against Goku. Uh, but even though there's, like, Archie Sonic, and I know how powerful Archie Sonic can be, and I've seen some pretty good fights between Goku and Archie Sonic, where sometimes Goku is lost and sometimes Goku's won, uh, depends on certain factors. But anyways, we're going to check out this awesome fight. I've been hyped to see this. Uh, he showed little bits here and there, teasing it. And we finally got it released. It was released a couple days ago, yes. But I was so busy this weekend because of uh, because of October's uh, events and me working at this. Uh, I had two part-time jobs. I really didn't have time to sit down. That's also why I haven't been posting a lot of reactions. That's why I've been streaming a ton. The streaming's a lot more easier. So, uh... Yeah, let's get into this fight. Uh, link in the description below. Go subscribe to Rewind. It's going to be a little bit before I get used to that. I'm so used to saying Animation Rewind. But Re Rewind Rumble. Link in the description below for the original video. Go subscribe to him. Like the video. <clears throat> and maybe check out Animation Rewind's Patreon and maybe Animation Rewind's channel. So let's get in this fight by Animation Rewind. Uh, but rewind. See, that's what I'm, I'm gonna have so much difficulties remembering to do that. I've gotten so used to it. <clears throat> Let's get the fight up. All right. So we're going to check this fight out and enjoy this fight right now. I did see his new intro for uh, this on Patreon myself. Oh, uh, there's a little bit of a snippet. A little bit of a, another show. Okay, Pikachu. Okay. You see a little bit of fights that maybe that probably are coming to this channel. I love the little animation and everything. It's awesome. <clears throat> Everyone has their demons. Even the greatest heroes have dark sides. The important thing is how you yep. tame the beast and Oh shit, I left that on. Whoops. Is inevitable. Some people do a good job holding That's only supposed to be on for streams. But others have lost or gave up and Sorry set about that. the beast free. Bring in Dark Sonic and Goku Black. Both are uniquely known for shepherding such an energy, but battling their inner demons isn't the only fight they are facing today. Today, we find out who wins the external fight. <laughs> today, we rewind Rumble. Hell yeah! I like this! To truly understand the value of a fight between Goku Black and Dark Sonic, you must first learn and understand who each of these beings are. Goku Black is best as- By the way, I am on, I am on the side of Goku he Black, so- the Goku we all know and love. His true identity is Zamasu from an unaltered timeline. Zamasu plotted a wicked idea to steal the appearance of Goku, used Goku's reputation to confuse those around him, and tried to attack the universe the current Goku was in. 
speaking of facades dark well he wasn't he didn't take his appearance he took his body but this time <laughs> that's why he got sonic so much extra power as host body as seen in the 67th episode of sonic x sonic finally clashes into metarex's base however he is confronted with a sleeping back there angel he wasn't expecting fake chaos emeralds originally fake chaos emeralds were meant to bear similarity to real chaos emeralds yeah. though they possess a different type of power since they were designed to sabotage machinery sonic however is bio logical life which moves us on to the power of both characters goku black is a force to be reckoned with when it comes to powers he he's no joke like he was he was still not he was still evolving and everything blue goku super saiyan blue vegeta and super saiyan rage trunks all of them are each universal powerhouses in their own right with this scale this would make goku black massively faster than light Universal destructive yeah. capability, extremely skilled, and <clears throat> very fierce and dirty fighter. He has his own Black Kamehameha and Super Black Kamehameha, which unlike Goku's light-colored attacks at that time, Black... One second, guys. As you probably can hear in the background, my dog is coughing a lot. I need to... I'll, I'll cut this part out, but I just gotta go give her her medicine. Be right back. Alright, guys. I'm back. Sorry about that. My dog is pretty old. She's 15. Uh, and she's had this cough for a little bit, and we we're just giving her medicine. So if you hear coughing in the background, she's now laying next to my foot, and she's somewhat falling asleep. But she still coughs occasionally. So, sorry about that again. Let's get into this fight. We're much darker and much more powerful. As for Dark Sonic, to find power, we can use the old Emerald Multiplication Formula. It takes seven authentic Chaos Emeralds to increase Sonic's power by 1,000%. Before Sonic turned dark, Damn. he was exposed to 14 different fake Chaos Emeralds in his lifetime. Now remember, this is multiplication, not Wait. addition. So the power of Dark Sonic should actually rise exponentially, giving Sonic a 1 million percent power increase instead of 1,000. 1,000 times 1,000 is 1 million. Of course, the true power of Dark Sonic is unknown, and a million percent increase could be considered a Highball. However, Sonic's power rose so high he couldn't control it anymore. The same Sonic who goes super casually in the Sonic X series and knows a thing or two about controlling chaos energy. So if he obtains so much God energy damn. He control, this should be something to consider. Now back to Goku Black. Black has a special form known as Super Saiyan Rose. His Super Saiyan Rose form is far more powerful than a Super Saiyan Blue form from that of both Goku and Vegeta. And he that was is true. on par with Super Saiyan Blue Vegito. Spoiler alert, but after a long fought battle, it finally took a Super Saiyan Blue Goku and Vegeta fusion into Vegito to overpower Goku Black in terms of power. But remember, well, not Goku, Goku Black, Black but Mercy Monster. And a time ring. The latter of which allows him to travel between different timelines at will. So after the battle, Zamasu was still able to exist. Although and Goku Black was still evolving, Vegeta was able to, to fully take erase this wicked mind. Goku Black when down a little bit because, but that just gave him as, uh, as they both have um, mental roadblocks that limit their Zen full Kaibus. potential. Dark Sonic acts in blind rage and pure anger, which results in far less tactical thinking and far more raw instinct. Goku Black is extremely cocky and arrogant. He thinks he knows that everything is true. that he is flawless. Both of these characters <laughs> share a unique bond with the dark side. Dark Sonic and Goku Black have many mysteries that are still unknown. And there we go. Day. There's the fight they right there where Goku Black is losing. Oh, is their own oh, yeah, he gets stabbed psyche. right there. It's been a while since I've seen that fight, too. It is now time we set ourselves a circumstance. This battle is going to take place in the Lava Reef Zone with no preparation. This Let's go! The home court advantage, which would increase his chance of victory. The fact that there's no preparation does give the mental state an even play field. And now that the my circumstance team. bar has finally loaded, it's time to rewind Rumble. Let's go! Ooh, new animation and everything. Redux. Nice. Here we go. Strange, what energy am I sensing?
Ooh, I like this animation. It is so good. Damn. Whatever you are, if you thought you could sneak up on me, you're something so, something so obvious. I really don't know who you're dealing with. And here we go, the fucking battle. Ooh. Damn, Dark Sonic going in on him. Now I'm wondering, is, is he going to go with normal Super Saiyan or Super Saiyan Rose? Ooh! Ooh, that looked like it hit him in the nuts! Go black giving no fucks. Well, he should have gave a fuck, I guess, because he just took that in the face and landed in lava. I'm guessing Super Saiyan? <clears throat> nope, Super Saiyan Rose. Straight into Rose. Fatal mistake. Oh, slice and dice! Hold up! That looks like a Beerus move! Oh! Oh! Oh, Dark Sonic is getting fucked up right now! This music in the background is epic as fuck! Oh, here we go! Oh, the Dark Kamehameha! Nice! God damn, everything has been re revamped. I like the transition here with that uh, I really hope you molecule enjoy that thing. Animation. Special thanks to Drew Visx. This guy is extremely talented. Not only is he a Redux animator, but an all-around great guy in general. He definitely deserves That's more awesome. attention within the animation community. He is insanely talented. Also, special Hell thanks yeah, to yes. Shane, BTL Video Productions, Anime Freak 17, and Sonic Man 1006 for gathering all the information and stats for both characters. Once again, I did hope you enjoyed this, and I hope you enjoy what's in store for this channel. Please stay tuned till the end of this video to find out who's next and to get an important update on this channel as well as the Animation Rewind channel. Thanks, and now for the post analysis. Alright, let's check out this. Bam, bam, bam. Goku Black has claimed victory over Dark Sonic, and we are about to discuss the many reasons why. Oh, I like how Dark Sonic is laying down superior now. superior to Dark Sonic in almost every way imaginable. Now, of course, we don't know the true power or peak of each character. So at the very least, we that give is each true. character a very generous estimation and very generous highballs. The worst place to start any Sonic debate is speed, but it's the best place to hammer in just how different the power levels each character is statistically. I've said this many times in the past, but surely it would be nice to give Sonic the speed edge just through association of being known as a speedy character. But the hard reality is, Goku Black and higher tier Dragon Ball Super characters have consistently shown faster speed feats than Sonic has in the Sonic X series. Remember, Sonic Roasted. X Super Sonic is <laughs> from Game Modern Sonic. In the Sonic X episode, A Cosmic Call, Super Sonic traveled great distances in space. Using star measurements, Super Sonic traveled roughly one light year in about 32 seconds, making him 100,000 times the speed of light. If we use the Dark Sonic multiplier discussed in the pre-analysis, this would make Dark Sonic 100 million times. My phone's times playing the in the background. Sorry this about that. I guess I'm getting a phone call. Fast. The only crazy thing is I that left it in the other room. Is much much faster. As calculated by Revolution, 
base Goku traveled from King Kai's planet to Earth, which is a distance of half the observable universe in two days. This would make this feat roughly 600 billion. Now you guys are hearing the fucking. Uh, now, if we use Saiyan multipliers all the way to Dragon Ball Super, Super Saiyan Blue Goku, Goku would reach 342 decillion times the speed of light. And that's not considering the fact that Goku Black was much faster than Super Saiyan Blue Goku, but on par with Super Saiyan Blue Vegito. Just with this speed yeah. gap alone, things are no longer fair. But that's not where the gaps end. Oh, Goku Black that's one thing I will say in this he kind of did a mistake on. The best thing we can do for Dark we never Sonic saw Vegito fight Goku Black, so we don't know exactly if he was on par with the solar system level Dark Oak. Like, this would make I'll give, I'll give you the fact that, yes, plus in all he's categories, merged with which is another Zumasu, and, even and with that he's probably the 80% of the power. Because the regular Zumasu was no threat, not even stronger than Super Saiyan 2, of time. But, and, he acts and he was probably about 80% like of merged Zumasu's strength. As he loses the but at the same time, we can't pull and guarantee it. Now, Goku Black isn't some calm, Unless it was in the manga. I could be wrong. I haven't read the manga of Super in a while. Son. So I Goku could be forgetting Black had something. The skill level to precisely stab Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta and beat him. Dark Sonic and Goku Black share many mysterious similarities, but the main difference is that Dark Sonic holds back his demons while Goku Black lets them run free. While this does make Sonic that a is far true. better and more moral individual, it makes Goku Black the winner of the first Rewind Rumble. Now, Hell yeah! Goku Black versus Bizarro, back in that episode, we offered the anti-hero free-for-all. And that free-for-all is still up for grabs. And we'll nice. combine the likes of both videos, both that one and this one. So be sure to like this video if you want to see an anti-hero free-for-all with the likes of Wario, Shadow, Goku Black, Bizarro, and many more. If the combined total reaches 25,000 more likes, which is how many likes needed left, that free-for-all will happen. Also, nice. Okay, guys, go do that. Link in the description the below. Rewind Rumble update and to find out who's fighting next on the next episode of Rewind Rumble. See, even he's having. I could tell he he probably had to practice that a little bit. Ooh, pathetic humans. Great. Who are you? I am the ultimate life. So, a shadow versus Sasuke. That's right up next is Sasuke versus Shadow. Shadow will beat Sasuke easily. I'm not exactly sure when, but it should be out next month. This series is so early and new, I don't have an exact schedule, and I don't know how fast I want to produce each of these episodes for two major reasons. One, they're extremely expensive. A Rewind Rumble costs far more than, say, a Joe Cartoon Flight Club episode. And I'm not sure yeah. how well these Rewind Rumble episodes are going to do. This channel is extremely new and small. So I'd appreciate it. Honestly, I would say one, maybe. Series. Two Special fights a month. Very cool reaction not real, like maybe, well, not maybe, maybe like every like ten of shout like, to Ninja DFX and Steven Z Killer. They both support me on Patreon. They both spread the word through their own channels, and I'm very thankful for that. So thank you. Hey! Me. If anyone else wants to support us on Patreon, it would be greatly appreciated. Just one dollar a month, which is essentially three pennies a day, could do wonders beyond imagine. You don't even know. The second reason why I don't have a set schedule yet is because regardless of the budget, these Rewind Rumbles do take a while to make. Quality is not only expensive, but it's also time consuming. This episode counting Definitely. all the time it took to animate took almost six months. Now clearly this took extra long due to getting original theme songs, new intros and everything. So future episodes, why they will still take a while, they should go at least quicker since those hurdles have already been jumped. Plus yeah. I still have to run Cartoon Fight Club on the Animation Rewind channel. Cartoon Fight Club is not going anywhere. Rewind Rumble wasn't created to end Cartoon Fight Club. It was created to split the serious fights from the meme fights. All of the Joe, Creepypasta, meme, and funny fights will be featured on Cartoon Fight Club, and the super high-definition serious fights will be on Rewind Rumble. Now, Cartoon Fight Club will still have serious fights. In fact, the next CFC is a serious battle between Goku and Godzilla. So for anyone who likes Looking Cartoon forward to that Club, one, definitely. Nothing to worry about. Nothing is changing with that. And for anyone who hated Cartoon Fight Club, I hope you give this new series a chance. It's my goal to really make this series something special. This is only the beginning, and if you enjoyed it, stay tuned for what the future has to hold. 
because our team is going yeah. to get better and more improved. But we need your help. To that was some cool looking art. Channel. That, that one in the middle. On like, Patreon, literally in the middle of the all, least, all, uh, in the fifth video one. On Facebook, Twitter, Google Plus, or text it to a friend. Animation on YouTube is really tough to sustain, so every share matters greatly. Also, I did decide to shuffle up how we did post and pre analysis for the research, mainly because this series is 100% serious, so I need to find creative ways to make this series unique. I haven't seen any other Versus show, at least that I know, that combines both characters in the same analysis. It's usually character X, character Y, fight Z, then post analysis. But I want to find a creative way to have everything just okay. nicely boxed in and easy I did to notice watch it was a little bit different. Over. Because I've <clears throat> noticed in Cartoon Fight Club Season 3, the audience retention shows viewers are skipping the post analysis for being very long. So I'm not sure if that's a problem or not. Now keep in mind that doesn't mean I do less research. In fact, we did more for this episode. But we are trying to find creative ways to present that stuff to you in a much quicker and more easier obtainable way. But let me know. I I think, think what you're doing that. is good, is honestly. Permanent. I could change it and go back to the old way, at least for the pre-analysis stuff, but if you liked it, then we could keep it. Once again, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you're excited for this series. I'm Animation It's Rewind, probably the people that, like, bitch and complain about, um, Animation Ryan, it's probably the people that bitch and complain about cartoon fight clubs, like, skipping and everything, that you don't do enough research. Those are the people that skip the fucking beginning and go straight to the animation. Those are the ones that are the assholes who say, Oh, this shit is bullshit. So, just ignore it and do things your way. It is your channel. Your way is the best way. It's You're still appeasing to your audience very much with uh, this whole new concept and even adding a secondary channel for the people who want more serious fights. So, yes. It is a channel for the fans, but it's also still your channel. Um, so don't make it where you feel like you're not happy with it. And sometimes uh, you just gotta do things a certain way to make yourself happy. So don't think at all. Think of all the hate and everything. You're doing an amazing job. Keep it up, man. I've seen you go from a little bit over 20,000 subscribers. You were at 24,000 a fit like when I first found you, or a little bit over that, to over 400,000. Like here, let me go get, get let me get let me get the actual number right now of where you are. As I am doing this reaction, you are Uh come on computer low. There we go. Okay. Go to my channel, go uh, you're at f almost 4 uh, 450,000 subscribers. Yep, 443,844 subscribers. You've come a long fucking way and you done it your way and you enjoy doing it your way. You've improved, you've gotten better, you've gotten outside help to get smarter, get better, and work harder. At the same time, still enjoy it. So, just, just keep doing it the way you like. Don't worry about all the hate. Uh, literally, haters are a dime a dozen. They're everywhere. And there's no way to stop them. So, just enjoy it. So, until next time, guys. Don't forget to check out uh, Animation Rewind and re Rewind Rumble. <laughs> um, and also, if you guys like to, check out some of my streams and other things. That's on my channel. You can subscribe, hit that notification bell, follow me on Twitter, and even punch that like button. So, until next time, guys. Later! Thanks for watching this video everyone. Hope you enjoyed it and if you want more check out the description below. Hope to see you guys in a later video. Also, have an awesome day.